Now, I'd heard Talitha's name kind of floating around mostly on YouTube of people giving reviews, but I have never ever ordered from them in my entire life. Talitha actually approached me and asked me if I would like to try out some of their clothes and obviously I was like, yes. Yes, I do. Now, when I first looked on the website, I was a little bit like, whoa, like, I feel like there's a lot going on here. Like, where do I start? I went, where well, I always go on a new website, to the new in page, and there was actually some really, really nice pieces, and I've been so excited to get this order. So this was delivered yesterday. It did take around two weeks to come. The aim of today's video is to find out whether it's worth you spending your money on. Is Talava one of those websites that you order from and you're like, what, what is this? Or is it a hidden gem that we're gonna find some really nice pieces in? Well, continue watching to find out. And through the website, the first thing I kind of picked up on is it's really, really affordable. Like, we're talking like really affordable and that's what got my little alarm bells a ringing. I was like, is someone trying to scam me here? Like, is this a scam? Is this real? Am I gonna get loads of like cookies come up on my laptop like blah, 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 virus, virus, warning, your laptop needs to restart. That wasn't the case, just to clear up that. But let's get straight into the haul. I have got quite a few pieces of knitwear, obviously, because my name's Joanne Miles. I love knitwear. I live in knitwear, even in the summer. Throughout the whole summer, I pretty much wore jumpers. People looking at me like I'm crazy, but I love knitwear. But the first item I picked up was a grey jumper, shock horror. It has got a roll neck, which I love. I just think roll necks always look so nice. They're great to keep you warm. So the material on this is almost like a waffle knit. Is that what you'd call it? And it's this beautiful dark grey. It looks like it's going to be quite long as well. So I feel like you could wear leggings with this um, and not feel too exposed. Okay, so the first thing I have to say about this jumper is it's so soft it's not itchy i was a little bit worried that it was going to be like that scratchy material but it's so soft the fit is really really nice i feel like this would look really really nice under a little jacket it's the perfect length it's not too long but then i feel like you could wear leggings with it and not feel too exposed so the next piece of knitwear i picked up was exactly the same jumper but it's in this like light orange color now i think i was expecting this to be a bit more of like a burnt orange because I'm a little bit scared of pastel colours, like I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie. Like this dressed up with the right clothes, I feel like will look really, really nice. So I'm kind of thinking this with maybe like an oversized camel coat and some jeans, I just think it's gonna look cute. Okay, being completely honest, I didn't think I would like this colour on me, but I actually really love it. It's exactly the same fit as the grey one I just showed you, it's like a pastel orangey colour and it's a vibe. I'm really enjoying it. Okay, so the next jumper, I know what you're thinking. Gemma, you do not do baby pink. Like, Gemma, you are not a baby pink kind of girl. I like baby pink things, but I'm not keen on baby pink clothes. But the model got me again every time. The model on the website gets me. So, I picked up this super oversized shock jumper but I thought this would look really cute off the shoulder and it's also got like these chunky sleeves which you know I'm a sucker for a nice sleeve so my vibe for this was kind of like chill at home no makeup on like hair in a big bun and then maybe some like gray joggers or gray leggings so you just I feel like this would be such like a cute nice color and also a while ago when I tried on a pink jumper you were all like Gemma that looks really nice and I was like oh I wish I hadn't taken it back so oh my god this is the most slouchy jumper in the whole entire world it's really loose fitting you can wear it off the shoulder it's got these lovely don't mind my cat just going crazy in the background it's got these really like loose sleeves which i love which you can turn up. amazing thing about this jumper is it's longer at the back than it is at the front which i absolutely love i feel like you could also wear like a cute little belt with this if you wanted to bring it in at the waist a little bit but for me this is like the perfect chilling jumper you're feeling a bit bloated you know you don't want anything tight i really really love this I hate to say it, but I picked up another teddy bear coat. But this is different to all the ones I have, okay? So the reason I went, reason, the reason, wow, what happened to your voice, babe? So the reason I picked up this is because it was like a bummer. I don't have a teddy bear bummer. I know what you're all thinking. Gemma, you've got loads of teddy bear coats. No, 
I don't have a teddy bear bomber. So I am so, so impressed with this, like really impressed. When I ordered it, I was kind of like, mm, I feel like it's going to be one of those that looks really nice on the website and you get it and it doesn't look anything like it and it doesn't feel how you imagined it to feel. But I'm actually so impressed with this. Now, what I love most about this coat is it's so lightweight, which I love. I don't like anything too heavy. I feel like it's perfect for if you wore it out shopping, you know when you get a bit hot and flustered walking around the shops and you want to like stuff your coat in your handbag, this is that kind of coat. That was a really weird description of a coat, but that's the scenario that I face quite a lot. Like I feel like when I wear this, I'm just going to feel like I'm being hugged by a bear. I am literally in love, in love with this jacket. Oh my god, it's so nice. Like it's because it's a bomber jacket, it's like a really just lovely, lightweight little jacket. I don't think I'd personally wear it with these grey leggings. I'd probably wear this with like an all black outfit. I feel like that always looks really nice. It's not too warm as well, so it's like perfect for like shopping days out where you don't want to be like boiling. I would definitely suggest getting this in an oversized fit because I feel like it just looks so much better. You can kind of like have it over the hip when it's done up. It's just going to look so nice i love how oversized the arms are as well that's why i always buy any jumpers or jackets in an oversized size in an oversized size um because i like them to have like a lot of room in the arms because you could wear like a nice hoodie under it or a nice jumper i'm gonna shock you all a little bit now when i unpackaged this order from talibar i saw this item and i was like why did i order that like that's not me nah that's not me <laughs> Then I tried it on and I was like, wow, I actually really, really love this. So I picked up this sweatshirt. Now it's cropped, but the best part about it is it has this little um, toggle. Called a toggle? Yeah, it's called a toggle. So it's cropped, but you can make this bit tighter if you don't have acrylic nails on. You can make this bit tighter, which makes it more cropped. So when I put this on, I was like, oh my god, I actually love this. And it's high neck, so you can even have it like unzipped a little bit, like a little bit. Oi, cheeky, oi, oi, cheeky. Or you could wear it with the neck done up. Now, I feel like this is perfect for like the gym, chill attire. Oh, I, I honestly really love it. And to be honest, when I got it out of the packet, I was like, mmm. I, this is actually potentially one of my favourite jumpers guys, like I just think it's so different, so I love the different patterns on here, like the colour blocks, I love the arms, you know I've got an obsession with like sleeves, I love this like bat wing, bat wing, I always feel so funny when I say that, this like bat wing style sleeve, I think it's so flattering, and then you've got this little toggle, like if you wanted you could have this really cropped, you could have it slightly longer, or you could have it without any elastic in it at all, and it just kind of sits like this. But like I said to you guys, this isn't something that I would normally wear, so it's nice to try something new and actually like really enjoy it. So I picked up, this quite long, this gorgeous trench coat, which is just gorge. Like, oh my gosh, I actually love it. I don't own a coat like this. Um, and I just thought, do you know what? That is going to look so nice. I'm going to get so much wear out of it. Now, as you can see, it's quite creased because it has been, obviously, in a delivery, travelling all the way from the other side of the world to my doorstep. So I do need to give that a really good iron. But I will tell you now, the quality of this honestly feels amazing. I was really scared this was going to turn up again and be like a paper bag and I was going to be like, oh, but it's not. It's really, really nice material. I feel like you can dress this up with so many different things. Now, I got this oversized as well. I got it in a large. I kind of wish I had got this in maybe a small or medium, you know. Because I love my clothes to be oversized. I always opt for, like I said, one or two sizes bigger. So if I was able to try this on in a shop, I probably would have gone for a small. But I've got a large and that's fine because, again, the larger the coat, the better. The larger the clothes, the bigger the food, baby. We can eat loads this winter. We don't have to worry about our clothes being too tight. And I just feel like, as well, if you've got a big coat, you can wear a big snuggly jumper underneath. You can wear a hoodie. I just feel like it's better than being too small. I love this coat so much. 
when I first unpackaged it I wasn't expecting it to be this nice it does need a little bit of an iron obviously because it has been folded up but the fit of this is actually really really lovely I wish I'd got this in a smaller size but like I said I wasn't sure on their sizing so I just thought it's better to oversize than undersize um, I love the collar detail I'm five foot four and it comes just below my knees you could really dress this coat up or down I feel like you could wear it in the daytime with like a casual outfit underneath or you could wear it at night for that like really smart coat because I did get this in a slightly bigger size than I would have wanted it's got the tie it's got the tied waist so I can always just kind of pinch myself in at the waist if I do feel like it just kind of drowns me so that's another really good thing I love the little tortoiseshell buttons on here and then last but not least I picked up something that I definitely didn't need standard can I get a pound for every time I say that? Because I would be a rich woman. A very rich woman. So I picked up a denim jacket because I've got a little denim jacket collection going on. Like a lot of things. No, I just thought this would be really, really nice. I wanted to try out a denim jacket mainly for you guys just to see what the quality is like, what the sizing is like, whether it's worth you buying from there. So here is the denim jacket. What I will say about this denim jacket is I ordered it in a size to be oversized and it's definitely not oversized. I would say this kind of makes me feel like it's about a size 8 or 10. Do you know what I mean? Like it's very fitted, especially around the shoulders, around the waist. But that being said, I do really like it, but I was expecting it to be kind of more oversized. I don't really wear fitted denim jackets but it is again really lovely quality it's like a good denim i really love the color i actually really like the little rips because most of my denim jackets are like extreme ripped i feel like this is like a nice subtle little rip let's give a little review on talibur clothes now do i think it is worth you spending your money on yes I feel like their clothes are really affordable. You guys know if I didn't like something, I would never tell you I liked it. If I got something delivered to me and was like, oh my god, that is terrible and I hated it, I would not be like, oh my god, this is amazing. Everything in that haul, I'm actually really bloody impressed with. Every single thing I've spoken about today is going to be linked in that description box below. If you want to check it out, then please don't forget to have a look in the description box. <laughs>